In this example, we want to determine uh, which of the following graphs uh, could be the graph of a polynomial function. So recall uh, that the graph of a polynomial function is going to be a smooth, unbroken curve, and the domain of a polynomial function is all real numbers. So uh, if we use those two clues, that can help us determine uh, if a graph uh, can be a, a, the graph of a polynomial function. Uh, so let's look at this uh, first curve that's graphed in A. So notice that is a smooth, unbroken curve. And um, the domain, indeed, appears to be all real numbers. Uh, so it looks like uh, uh, the graph shown in A could be uh, the graph of a polynomial function. On the other hand, notice uh, that this curve shown in B uh, is not smooth uh, because it has a sharp turning points uh, on it. And so um, that cannot be the graph of a polynomial function. Uh, because, again, the graphs of polynomial functions have to be smooth curves, and they cannot include uh, sharp corner points or sharp turning points uh, as part of the graph. Um, now, uh, C is a smooth curve, uh, but it's not unbroken. Notice there's a break here in the graph. And so, although this is the graph of a function, uh, it cannot be the graph of a polynomial function uh, because of the uh, break. And finally, uh, D... Well, D is not even the graph of a function, uh, and polynomials are functions. Uh, notice D is not the graph of a function because it's not going to pass uh, the vertical line test. Uh, so the only possible uh, graph of a polynomial function amongst these four examples is um, A.